What's really interesting is that so many people have come to the energy to find out how they can really be successful every day. And one of the things that required that everybody has said has been a requirement for their success is they got to stay on an upward, continuous, successful motion towards the goals that they want. And they can't be thrown off. And one of the things that throws people off has to do with some of the information that we're going to give you today that's related to the fact that you can be thrown off when somehow it becomes really important to you to get angry. Some people find that when you get angry, it like is a release, or maybe you feel like your body is now all of a sudden coming more strong, or you're feeling like, you know, I'm more certain about what I'm thinking now. And people even write stories about, well, it's better that if you're depressed, it's better that you get angry because that'll pull you up. At least that's a motion up the emotional scale. But the truth is that if everybody could recognize that if you want your goal, if you want to be successful, if you really want to have happen the things you want to happen, and what if you want to have not just one thing, but what do you have five things? What do you want your relationships, the people you're working with at work? You want to create something new for the world. You want to make a ton of money. You want to get healthy. You want to get to the gym in time in the afternoon. You want to be with your kids in the evening. You want to actually create a new vacation. You have all these things you want to do. That's multitasking. You don't have time to be angry. Don't do it. It really doesn't add to the picture. It doesn't motivate you forward. It does raise your blood pressure. It will give you a stroke. It will give you a heart attack. It will destroy your neck and your shoulders and your back. It has a wonderful number of, you know, peripheral collateral damages. But right now, all I want you to do is recognize that we have information today for you to read that has to do with presentations I've made that are so into the vibration of not having to have anger enter your space. What if you could have your space be one where you're just completely on fire, excited from the minute you wake up in the morning? Yeah, you aren't angry about, that's right, you could find something to be angry about. You're not angry about that. You, it, it's not like that useful. Why don't you like get into action? Don't get angry, get into action. It's a different A. But you having your blood pressure go up, you having yourself grit, you're having yourself deciding that, well, I'm so angry, I want to either kill or blow up or destroy whatever the problem is in front of me, whether it's a person or whether it's a, some letter or somebody's communication. None of those are the action that will get you the right result next time. Remember, it's so important that you pick and choose the things you want to win at every day, and you can win at those things if you apply this wonderful energy that we're giving you with the vibrations that we have for you to get in the videos and the audios. They're all there for you, and they're in the blog. All you have to do is focus on your goal and use this energy and you will be making it immensely faster than you will by being diverted with huge anger attacks that not only cost you physically yourself, but also doesn't really make friends. You've noticed not a lot of people come around you when you're being angry. So I'm not saying that you're using anger, but if somebody tries to convince you to do that, I would recommend you listen to this video again and realize that you can do it better. You can be more successful if you use the energy. I wish you great success, okay?